Hey everybody, Chef Greg here and Chef Ben here. One of the things that's so popular in the industry right now is chicken tenders. Today we have fairly small chicken tenders and we're gonna do it in two different batters and breaders. Uh, the first one is a old fashioned, old style kind of uh, breading. And what that is is cornflakes and some penny penny mix and a slightly sweet batter. You'll see that the chicken is under ice. You always wanna keep the chicken cool and at proper temperature. Chef Ben is doing a simple wet dry method and then we'll put it into the uh, pressure fryer that we're gonna use. It's an easy process that you can do at your restaurant or your facility. It's so many concepts are coming out with chicken tender recipes and different menu items. So right now, Chef Ben is gonna start putting these beautifully breaded tenders inside the pressure fryer, it's our forehead. We already pre-programmed this earlier. He's gonna take the lid, slam it shut, spin it so the red goes all the way around, perfect. He's gonna hit the number right here, and now it's cooking. A lot of people who are familiar with pressure fryers are like, holy smoke, Chef, there's not enough chicken in that pressure fryer for that to get pressure. Well, you hear that noise? That's perfect timing. I couldn't have asked for any better timing. These pressure fryers have pressure assist. So what that means is when you have a small volume of chicken or product going into the fryer, it will create its own pressure up to 12 pounds and so that it will cook just like it was a full load. Yep. Um, so if I had 20 pounds of food in here or if I had two tenders alone, it's gonna cook the same and it's fantastic. We have about two and a half minutes left on this before it's ready and we'll go from there. So Chef Ben just opened up the fryer and we're gonna pull these chicken tenders out, put it onto our holding station right here. We'll take these chicken tenders and put them inside the warming cabinet where we tested these to be held uh, at 185 degrees, 15% humidity. And it holds uh, fryer ready. And what I mean by that is it tastes like it just came out of the fryer for about 45 minutes to an hour. We've held them as long as two hours and based off of your uh, procedures and recipes in your quality standards, we can extend that time more or less and get it to where you need it. And all this stuff works fantastically well together. So the chicken tenders just came out of the fryer. Beautiful color. I mean, these are, th these are great. It's perfectly cooked, they're moist and tenders take on the flavor that you give it. So we have a cornflake breader and jalapeno honey a seasoning blend. Oh, that's good. Hope you enjoy, I know we are. With Henny Penny as your partner, you've got this.